Hello, brothers and sisters in Christ. I've got a very unusual article to bring to you from the Hal Turner radio show, although this is an article on his, um, I guess this is his website, and uh, I'll put the link to this in the description box, but it's called, uh, it's for the nation, Strange Preps at Walmart, Entire Aisles, parentheses, with food and goods, closed parentheses, sealed off with, quote, no selling of these items, unquote, signs. Loads of emergency survival foods filling shelves. Wonder where in the country this is. I need some boots on the ground, people to go to Walmart and see what you can find. Take some pictures and send them to me at genihardesty at gmail.com. Let's get some corroboration on this. Is this for real? See, I don't go. They take us once a week on Tuesdays. But you have to be down there at 8.45 or 9.30. There's two trips usually. If enough people are signed up. You know, most people want to go at 8.45 and stay the whole two hours. Because you only get 50 minutes to shop. I don't go. I just soon avoid the crowds. I order groceries and I have them delivered I order everything online so anybody who shops at Walmart or doesn't mind shop going to one just to look snap a couple pictures like you're talking on your phone see if you can find this okay let me read something seems to be very wrong at a number of Walmart stores and people are starting to notice first several aisles filled with foods and products, are sealed off with signs saying they cannot sell these items at this time. Other aisles are being filled with survival foods. New York Prepper is selling them too, y'all, if you're interested. I don't know how they price out compared to Walmart, but I saw a bucket here in this picture of this video there is a video on here and it is on YouTube and I watched it and there's a bucket of survival food down here that looks very much like the one my daughter bought me for Christmas about five years ago all right it says um the one minute and 30 second video below says more in that brief time than we can write you know they say a picture is worth a thousand words and that's the truth. Give it a watch. Then prepare. Clearly something wicked this way comes. Okay, so that's all there is to it. And there's this little short YouTube video on here showing huge cans of stuff and these survival foods down here on the bottom shelf. Or the bottom two shelves. Yeah, I'm leaving mine for my one friend. She's got a key to my place, so in case I go to the hospital, she'll take care of my dog and stuff. She's the only other one besides me that's unchanged. Okay, so I'm going to end this here. I'll pull my camera up and say, um, just click. Well, I could try to find the link. I got to link the article just because I got it here. And you can click on the YouTube video that's in the link. All right? All right. With that, I'll say God bless each and every one of you. I'll talk to you again soon. Bye-bye for now.